हरे कृष्णा कंटेम्पलेशन ऑन टेम्पटेशन चेंजेस आवर डिस्पोजिशन फ्रॉम जीरो टॉलरेंस टू जीरो रेजिस्टेंस वेन वी रिजॉल्व टू गिव अप सम टेम्पटेशन वी माइट डिजाइड दैट आई एम गोइंग टू हैव अ जीरो टॉलरेंस अप्रोच टू इट से somebody recovering from addiction may be told, now don't go anywhere near your uh, vulnerabilities. And if some somehow it comes within, move away from it immediately. So a zero tolerance approach means that where there is danger, we don't give any scope for the danger to ambush us. And this is the safest approach. However, the opposite of zero tolerance is zero resistance. Say for example, if some terrorists are trying to infiltrate into a country, a zero tolerance approach means nobody. without the proper documents without being with uh, without having gone through the proper scrutiny process absolutely nobody is allowed inside zero resistance means that whoever wants they they are let in they are just a little pushy they force themselves then they are just passively allowed to come in now this a uh, zero resistance approach would led to a country being uh, run over by infiltrators and suppose the same guards who had been told to have a zero tolerance approach suddenly change to zero resistance we would be shocked what happened we would say that have somehow these uh, guards turned be turned traitors or have they been seduced so it would be a matter of great alarm so if we consider our consciousness like the territory to be guarded then we often with our intelligence guard the territory of our consciousness and decide that we will have a zero tolerance approach toward our indulgences unfortunately when the temptation comes up the temptation seems so attractive and if we contemplate on it suppose some uh, infiltrators are very sweet talkers and they talk so sweetly that the guards voluntarily put down their guns and welcome the infiltrators so we would consider such guards is foolish and such infiltrators who can sweet talk so 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 seductively will be considered very dangerous so temptation is like like that seductive sweet talker when temptation comes in front of us if we start contemplating it then that contemplation it erodes our defenses we start thinking oh this is so enjoyable why should i not indulge in it and thus we give in krishna talks about this dynamic uh, when he says that if our intelligence is alert if we are in the mode of goodness then we see that even if there is sweet talking that there is a law that this person is a traitor and there's a long tail of trouble behind it and this is the vision in the mode of goodness krishna talks about how we see sensual pleasures when we are in the mode of goodness we see that vishayendriya sanyoga yatad agre amritopamam parinaame vishamiva tat sukham raj samsmritam we see that that although there is an initial nectar that is like the sweet talking person but this person has a knife they are going to stab me from behind once i let lower my guards so pariname bishamiva there is immense distress that comes thereafter and that's so now if we contemplate the initial nectar we will get captivated if we cont- contemplate the eventual poison we will stay alert so the zero tolerance approach comes when we use our intelligence to remember that Uh, there is a long tail of poison the zero resistance comes up when we look at the initial nectar and think oh what is, why should i resist this so if we contemplate the senses krishna says in 2.62 and 63 what happens is dhyato vishayan bumsah sangaste shu pajayate sangat sanjayate kamah kamat krodho bijayate krodhat bhavati sammoha sammohat smriti vibrama smriti bhramashat buddhi nasho buddhi nashat pranashyati so buddhi nashat pranashyati contemplation destroys our intelligence 
and when the intelligence is destroyed we become destroyed so we need to con not contemplate on the initial nectar of sense pleasure but at all if you have to contemplate we don't dwell don't look at the sense pleasure but with our intelligence remember the consequence the eventual poison and then we can maintain the zero resistance zero tolerance approach and guard ourselves thank you hare krishna